the dependency that you mentioned uh, earlier is going to show itself uh, cruelly uh, when uh, the Iraq-Iran war started in September 1980 because the equipment is American. The parts, they need to be uh, replaced uh, uh, continuously, and uh, there was an embargo established by the Americans. Billions of dollars uh, worth of equipment that the late Shah purchased from the U.S. remained in the U.S., so they were not delivered. The uh, hostage crisis, obviously, was uh, one of the main reasons uh, uh, the American hostage crisis and uh, uh, then the American administration imposed uh, sanctions on uh, on Iran. So this is why uh, the Iranians during war, they started uh, to cannibalize uh, the, the, the armaments that they had. For example, the, uh, the uh, um, F-4 uh, planes that they had, uh, the American built, they took parts from one plane to put on the other one to, to make it ready to go uh, to, to for the mission and so forth. So that was the uh, um, the state of uh, uh, the Iranian access uh, to its uh, very, very sophisticated uh, armaments that it had, but, but because of the uh, uh, parts, uh, they were not capable really to make good use of all that. So this is why uh, one way uh, 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 to clean up uh, the mine field that uh, 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 was established by the Iraqis was just to send kids seven, eight, nine, 10, 12, 15 years old, just to go. This is why thousands of them really uh, got killed this way, that way. So just to clean up in order uh, for, the, uh, uh, for the forces, uh, for the revolutionaries and the army, uh, just to, to, uh, to advance.